Hey guys, welcome to my vlogging channel and I'm super excited about this channel because I could just kind of yap and yap and talk about random things that I find and kind of share with you everything that is going on sort of kind of and yeah, just be super excited about this channel. Okay, so so today I actually kind of want to talk about the new tablet that I bought and you guys are probably like, oh my gosh, I just thought you got a Galaxy Tab like three months ago. What's going on? Why are you buying another tablet? And you know what? I have a really good reason why I bought another tablet. Before I get into that, I kind of want to talk about the problem process on how I thought about buying the tablet and why I wanted to buy a tablet. Um, at first I tweeted everyone and I asked what kind of tablet would be awesome for Skechers and things like that and a lot of you guys actually responded with you know the bamboo tablet or one of the Wacom tablets that you could do and plug it into your PC and sketch on Photoshop and stuff. And, and what I was looking for was a PC tablet, not the tablets that we are also familiar with like the Galaxy Tab or the HP Slate or even the iPad. I was looking for basically a computer but in a tablet format. There's actually three that I was quite interested in. It was the HP TM2. Um, that's the one that was on Project Runway. Um, Lenovo has one and Toshiba has another one and I don't know the names on the top of my head. And those are extremely cool and they work great but the problem is that they are in a laptop format. So basically you know you open it up it looks like a laptop and then you swivel the screen over and then you slip it down and you kind of just draw on it like a tablet. Which is totally okay but it was a little bit too heavy for me. I kind of wanted something thinner, lighter, and sleeker and so I was complaining and complaining to my little brother and he's like the coolest guy ever because he's so up to date with all types of technology and what's out in the market right now so he introduced me to the Asus EEE -E -E Slate and it has to be the coolest tablet in the world but it was kind of hard to explain how awesome the E Slate is because it is ran on Windows 7 and not like OS or Android so that means you can install programs like Photoshop, Adobe Premiere and all those other great things in there and just work with it like it's a regular laptop but it's an awesome tablet form. Okay, so this is the Asus eSlate. As you can see, the screen is much bigger and it's also much wider. Also, it's a little bit thicker as well and it does come with a stylus and it is a Wacom tablet. Um, the coolest thing about this is that it comes with a program called Art Rage Program. It's really awesome if you're a beginning artist or if you're a long-term artist. You can really, really mess around and have a blast with this program. Um, I have also loaded Photoshop in here as well so I could carry it around and edit photos or edit sketches or anything like that. I actually don't own a laptop, I own a netbook. Now let me tell you something about netbooks. They are not a full-fledged out computer. You cannot run a lot of things on it. I mean, it's like the Galaxy Tab. You could just surf the internet, do emails, take notes, you know, simple things, run PowerPoint on this, or just have it around when you're in school. Now let me tell you, when I was going through my biology major, this was a huge lifesaver. I loaded all of my PowerPoint notes in here because when I was taking a lot of those courses, I had notes that ran to 50 pages long and I felt bad not only printing out that much paper, but I felt bad paying for that printing. The MSI and the Asus brand, personally for me, they run awesome. Like they are literally almost a laptop, let alone just a netbook. So if you're going to buy a netbook, I would really recommend checking in that MSI or Asus and definitely go on newegg.com to look them up because they have really awesome products and really awesome little netbooks like this for a pretty good price as well. By the way, I actually got this MS guy stolen from me once and the guy who stole it from me actually posted on Craigslist and my brother was checking out Craigslist and he saw it so we actually had to go to the guy's house to get this guy back. So yeah, I love, 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 love this netbook. And you know, in fact, my earlier, earlier videos were edited on this thing and I ran Adobe Premiere on this. Okay, so anyways, um, this is what ArtRage looks like, the program. It is really cool. Um, you also have your, your touch screen. This is pressure sensitive, so if you like push it down really hard, the lines are going to be darker. If you kind of just sketch, it will have really light, thin lines as well. It's really neat. Now, another cool thing about this is that it does come with a Bluetooth keyboard, so you could have this on the portfolio, standing on your table, and then have the keyboard next to you. So it literally acts just like a laptop. This is ran on Windows 7, so whatever you can do at home on a computer, you can do on this thing. Um, I really like it because it's about three and a half pounds and it's super easy for me to travel around with. And at school, I have to sketch designs a lot and there is no way, no way that I could carry a notepad. I, there's no way that I'm gonna carry a box of markers or even color pencils with me every single time because I'm already hauling around fabric and scissors and all these other tools. So 
all of that stuff can now be given away and I all I need is just this thing. Another thing about my sketches is that they're really bad. So every single time I'm done sketching, I always put it into Photoshop and re-render everything. So I'm definitely super excited about this thing. Like for the past three days, I have been sketching and playing on this like crazy and get served the internet. I could actually edit my YouTube videos on this, although I wouldn't because I don't want the memory to go bad and I already have a pretty badass PC as it is because my brother actually built my computer for me and yeah I'm really excited about it aside from being such a biology freak or aside from like makeup and sewing and stuff I'm very passionate about technology as well now if you're really interested in you know getting up to speed about all the cool things that are going on in the world definitely check out a website called tedtalks.com um, they always have all these really cool innovative ideas that are coming out and I think one of the person who spoke about you know the iPhone um, he did a speech a really long time ago coming out with this program at MIT where it is actually now embedded into the iPhone and that's how we have the awesomeness of an iPhone right now but uh, when I saw that I was like oh my gosh I gotta get that contraption and that thing was like a freaking box you know and, and it was cool to see how it's now in the iPhone but yeah that's just a little bit geeky side of me and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed my little rant on how I actually ended up deciding to buy this guy so anyways um, I hope you guys enjoyed Enjoy the little chit chat and uh, I hope you guys will enjoy this vlog channel I guess it will be a good way for you to get to know me a little bit more okay bye